everybody, this is Keith here of Euphoria Pictures. Welcome back to my channel. Right, folks, so this is going to be a quick video because it is incredibly warm outside. This room is really starting to heat up. And uh, I want to get through this before I actually collapse in front of you. Fingers crossed it does not happen. But it is going to be a simple unboxing video. And it is my latest 4K pickup release that I got for the Shawshank Redemption. And as you can see, this is volume 5 of the Film Vault series. And uh, I was counting down the days to finally get this in my hands. But in case you're not aware of this series, of course, there was four volumes before this one. I'm going to just quickly show you them, uh, show you them now. But the first, one, the first one to come out was Blade Runner. The artwork is absolutely exquisite on this one as well. And the 4K transfer, wow, really is the star of the show. Uh, the second volume was uh, Goodfellas. Now, the one downside to this release was the 4K transfer. It looks quite poor. As a matter of fact, I've done a top 10 of my worst uh, 4K transfers. And uh, Goodfellas, unfortunately, featured in that top 10. Very disappointing. Then the next, the third volume was uh, Scarface. Probably my favourite release out of them all. Uh, particularly in terms of artwork. And this was a first time watch for me as well. Took a bit of a gamble on it. And my god, it paid off. I had such a wonderful time with this movie. As a matter of fact, I'm due a rewatch on this. Because I had I enjoyed it that much. And uh, just look at the artwork on this. Absolutely exquisite. So that was number three. And then the fourth one was one that... People would question, should this be part of the series? It is 1917. But I have to admit, I could see this movie being uh, be regarded as a classic in time. You need to check this movie out if you're into his war movies. Uh, the way it's shot, it just looks like one continuous shot. I've never seen anything quite like it. And uh, yeah, great movie. And the 4K transfer is absolutely spectacular on that. So I've done videos for every single one of these and what I'm going to do is if you are interested I will leave a link in my description below and please do check it out and I have to tell you this, folks when you put all five of these together uh, when you see them on the shelf they do pair up absolutely perfectly and uh, I think you'll be ecstatic uh, to hear that. So uh, yeah the Shawshank Redemption look I don't have to talk about the movie you know what it's all about it's one of the greatest prison movies ever made stars Tim Robbins and Morgan Freeman and it's directed by Frank Darabont who seems to love adapting Stephen King movies because he done this he also done The Green Mile which is probably a contender for greatest uh, prison movie of all time as well up against this one it is quite a special movie that and he also directed The Mist which I'm happy to report is coming out in October on 4k and uh, yeah, I can't wait to get my hands on that one. But there is another movie that Frank Darabont directed that no one seems to ever talk about. And it's one of my favourite movies by him, amazingly enough, when you consider that he directed Shawshank and The Green Mile. But yes, he's done a movie called The Majestic, which stars Jim Carrey. And it's uh, hands down his best performance that I've ever seen. And if you, it's a real kind of one of those love letter to love letter movies to old Hollywood movies. And if you're kind of into that, I definitely recommend checking out The Majestic. It really is a special movie but um to finally get this release now in my hands really is special because i've never owned a collectible when it comes to this movie amazingly enough because it is regarded as one of the greatest movies of all time and the fact that we never got any kind of collectible for it it just doesn't seem right i didn't even want a steel book to it i think they brought one out there a couple of years back and it looked absolutely horrendous and uh yeah like i said great now to finally finally get uh, a collector's edition worthy of the movie itself as for special features you're well covered as well on this release there is two documentaries in there you also get a couple of featurettes so there's quite a bit in there and as for the 4k transfer folks i don't really have to talk about it because i've already done a video on it but it goes without saying it looks spectacular uh, the biggest testament i think i compare to its 4k transfer it actually looks like it was shot today it's just one of those amazing looking 4k transfers and if you haven't checked it out uh, pick one up now and uh, it's like watching the movie for the first time it really does look that good right folks i need to get out of this room so here we go here is the unboxing and uh, i hope you enjoy it Right, so here we go, the Shawshank Redemption. So I'm not going to spend too much time here because as you know with this uh, series, uh, you do get clear slips with it. Uh, so I want to be able to show you the artwork uh, in the best possible way. So I do want to remove that off in a second because as you can see, the light is reflecting off it. But I'm going to take this quickly onto the spine here. So of course you got volume five there and yeah, it matches up perfectly with the other four. And then right around to the back, it gives you a close look at everything that you get inside this. And there is quite a bit there. And uh, yeah, looking forward to showing you all of that. 
So I'm going to quickly take the slip off here so we can finally get a good look at the artwork here. And uh, wow, uh, it is spectacular. It really, really is. So as you can see, it is the scene where Andy escapes at the end of this movie. You can see a lot of the rainfall coming in, the lightning in the sky. It just looks perfect. And uh, I knew when I seen the pictures drop for this, I knew it was going to be quite special. And I'm happy that the pictures lived up to the actual release itself. But you will notice on the spine as well that the picture does kind of continue onto it, just like the opposite as well. And then right around to the back, you do have a picture of Andy Dufresne, and that's him going into the Shawshank uh, right at the start of this movie. Uh, I could have done without the credits, if I'm completely honest, at the bottom. So uh, just like every other uh, Film Vault series release, uh, it is magnetically sealed here. Uh, which is quite nicely done. So uh, I'm going to flip it open. Here we go. And uh, you do get a lot of quotes from the movie. Uh, and as you can see, there is another one. And as you can see, there, it is the picture of, uh, you know, the, the, the Shawshank prison itself or inside it. And then this is a big envelope you get with a couple of goodies. So uh, I'm going to start with this envelope and then we'll make our way into the actual contents inside. So as you can see, it is the little rock hammer that he got. Uh, during this movie. I knew that was going to feature somewhere in this release and uh, I wouldn't be bit, one bit surprised if it actually is heavily featured during this entire release. So it uh, looks great. Nice. I think there's a nice bit of spot glossing on the actual hammer itself. I think you can make it out there which is very nice. Is there anything on the spines of it? No, no. And then right around to the back there and as you can see it says Dear Warden, uh, you are right. Salvation lay within Andy Dufresne. Uh, nice touch on that. So, right, let's open it up and let's have a look and see what's inside. So here we go. So the first thing you will notice is you got some character cards. Now, the great thing about these character cards is when you actually turn it around, you get a quote from that character. So uh, I'm not going to spend too much time with it, but you've got the Andy Dufresne there. That's the quote. If you do want to pause it and just uh, yeah, check it yourselves, you can. So uh, then you've got Morgan Freeman and uh, what a performance from him in this movie. And that's his quote. And then, of course, you've got the warden himself, who is, uh, yeah, he's quite horrible in this movie. And uh, speaking of horrible, this fella's even worse. Clancy Brown, is that his name? I think that's the actor's name. And again, uh, great performance by him in this movie. And then you've got William Sadler there as well. So that's the back of it there. And then the last, this is, was this, his name is Tommy, I think, in the movie, as far as I remember. So that is the back of it there. Yeah, it is Tommy. So there you go, folks. That is all the art cards that you get there. Uh, then another thing you get here, which is quite brilliant, is the letter that Andy left uh, for Red under the stone. So uh, I'm going to quickly open that up for you and show it to you. But I have to tell you, is the paper feels absolutely amazing. I know, I don't know if it's coming across in the camera, but there is a lovely bit of texturing to the paper. I, I, I don't think the camera is picking it up, but trust me when I say uh, you are going to be very uh, impressed uh, by the paper on this, as ridiculous as that sounds, but trust me, you will know when you actually get the releases ourselves. But there you go, that is the letter. Uh, they actually read it out in the movie, uh, but if you do want to pause it and check it out yourselves, go right ahead. So uh, yeah, that's a very nice touch to put there to include that letter in there. So another thing you get as well is you get a small double-sided poster. Uh, as you can see, that is the artwork that we know and love for the Shawshank Redemption. And then when you flip it around, there we go, that is an alternate artwork. I think I have the uh, this artwork on a DVD edition, as far as I remember. And then another thing you get as well is another simple little poster. Now the paper feels amazing on this one as well. Kind of reminds me of the Arrow video releases that you get, the paper that they use. But as you can see, it is the newly commissioned artwork that we see on this release. So uh, yeah, quite amazing. So that's just a single sided poster. So right, I'm going to bring the release back in. I'm going to flip it open and give you a look at how everything sits inside it. And now... I need to check this. I should have probably checked it before actually doing the video. But I think they've done something over here with the crystal. They've actually secured... They seem to secure the inside here, which uh, which a lot of the crystals were kind of moving around on the previous four releases. So that's great that they actually done that. So here we go. This is the crystal. I don't know if I can get this. Let me see if I can actually move the box out of the way and see if I can get this into... Ah, but there we go now. So as you can see, you have the Shawshank kind of etched into the crystal here. It gives you a unique number. 
uh, minus 1,779 of 500. And again, nice to see that little hammer featuring on the crystal itself. So uh, yeah, I'm a big fan of these crystals. I think it's a nice touch. It's a very unique way uh, to get your, your, your number. So uh, there we go. That is the crystal itself. So let me open this up. Let me slot that back in. And then this lastly brings us on to uh, the discs themselves. So let me put that to a side again. And here we go. So as you can see, it says 245. And then you got the Shawshank Redemption in the bottom there. And you got the, car the cast there of Tim Robbins and Morgan Freeman. So uh, is there anything on the spines of it? Nothing there. And then right around to the back. And as you can see, you can, you can just make out uh, Peter there written. So there we go. Not, not, nothing else to see. So you slide it open. And it's a high gloss finish on this, which looks absolutely spectacular. But it is the scene, I think, uh, there's the scene which uh, I think Andy uh, got the beers for the lads. I think that's what it is. But um, there is a quote inside this, and it is from this scene here, as you can see. But uh, when I open it up in full, there we go. So it is a quote from that scene. And that is your two discs. And I'm not going to take them out, folks. All that's behind it is uh, Morgan Freeman and Tim Robbins. Uh, so I don't really have to take them out. But there you go. That is the main discs. And that's, yeah, that is the artwork on the back of it. So there you have it, folks. That is everything inside this amazing release of Shawshank. And uh, yeah, I'm so happy now that I finally got it in my hands. And thank God there was no damage to it. Right folks, so there you have it. That is the Shawshank Redemption. So if you are aware of this series, you have to know that Jaws came out as well this week. Now I don't have my release yet. It's coming sometime today. So I'm hoping to put a video together tonight for that. And uh, really can't wait to see that. The artwork looks spectacular on it. And I'm hoping maybe to have that video out on Wednesday for you. Fingers crossed everything goes well with that release. So there you have it, folks. So as per usual, if you did like what you see here, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you could do, leave a comment down below. And please do share your thoughts on this movie and what did you think of this release of it. And yeah, I hope to see you all again real soon with my next video. Until then, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.